Uh, in this session of trigonometry, we are going to learn to use uh, different trigonometric uh, ratios. Um, in this case, if you see, we have um, been given a right angle triangle and uh, one angle is given to us and the length of one of the sides is given to us and we are supposed to find out the length of this side. Okay, so the first thing we do is of course mark the triangle. So opposite to right angle, we have hypotenuse marked as H and opposite to the angle, it's marked as O. And the remaining one is of course A. And I write down the uh, mnemonic. So I have so ka to and since there is no information about A, I'm not going to use any function which contains any any ratio which contains A, which means of course I will not be able to use Toa and Cos. So I'm left with the sine function and I'll use that sine 31.3 degrees equals to O. O is 7.4 and H is Z. Z is the unknown I need to find out. Now, such type of equations, there are plenty of ways to solve uh, it. One of the ways that I use and prefer is to take the reciprocal so that it's easier for me to cross multiply. So I'll take the ratio on both the sides. Why I'm doing this is because Z is in the denominator. So when I take the reciprocal, it comes in the numerator. So I have taking reciprocal on both the sides, I get one upon sine 31.3 degrees equals to Z upon 7.4. Now, when I cross multiply, what I get is 7.4 upon sine 31.3 equals to Z. Now, I'm going to use um, calculator and get the value of Z correct to three decimal, three significant figures. So, I have uh, 7.4 divided by sine 31.3 degrees and that gives me uh, 14.2 centimeters and this is correct to three significant figures. That's how we solve this problem.